Hi guys and welcome back. We're here with a new campaign playing as the Byzantine Empire in Europa Universalis 4. And it's with a mod called Overpowered Byzantines, which just basically makes the Byzantines very, very strong. And uh, still beatable, but uh, a bit harder to beat. Um, and when they get bigger, obviously, it'll be even harder to beat them. But um, So yeah, it's basically we're trying to remake the Roman Empire as the goal. So from England to Syria. You know, and then like Morocco to like the Danube and like the the classic Roman Empire. So that's our aim. Um, sorry if it's a little bit small. I've like had to sort out my uh, like all the little things up there. I don't think it should be, but um, because I had to sort out the resolution just so it recorded properly. So it actually was a full screen. Um, like so, this is my second attempt technically actually doing the campaign um, because the first time it wasn't in the right resolution and it would have been awful for you guys. You would have had like a really small screen. But anyway, so let's go on with the campaign. Um, so first thing we need to do, set some rivals. We'll uh, set Moldovia as a rival. I'm, I'm going to start it off quickly. Um, we'll put Venice and I guess Genoa, I guess. We've not got many rivals. Anyway, so we'll do that. And then let's start Hungary. The people that you always want to attack. It's so small. So different to last time I like played and it's a little bit bigger. Anyway, so that's what we need to do. Get Hungary to like us. Um, we might as well get Athens to like us as well. Because then we can annex them. And then... Um, let's recruit some infantry. Let's just recruit all the medieval infantry in the world. And then let's appoint a general. Uh, my king. Or emperor can do. And he's a three star. As, as you can see, they're instantly three star general. So uh, that shows how, how strong that th this... Uh, yeah, this mod can make the Byzantines instantly a three-star general. I'm pretty sure he's not in reality. Um, to form an alliance, we're going to need a lot more people to like us. Anyway, let's get it to four speed. Oh, pardon me. I don't know why I've got indigestion. Anyway, don't need to know about me. Um, anyway, as we're going through this, thank you very much, by the way, guys, for 300 subscribers. A little bit late, as we are... Going on to almost 320, I think, at this point. Um, but yeah, I really appreciate the support and the likes and the comments. Everything. It really, you know, it just really makes my day when I see that. And I like you guys interacting. Uh, really does help. And uh, with the channel as well. Along with making my me happy. And a happy Pope's always good. It means you don't have crusades if you have a happy Pope. Uh, build force limit done. So as you can see here, this is all our missions. Um, we'll quickly go through them. So we've got Recover Greece, which is our first day. We will recover Greece. So that's like all of this down here, which is pretty easy. We can do that. Then we've got to reconquer Bulgaria, which is here. And then we've got to secure a bit of southern Italy, which is from Naples. I'm pretty sure we can take them out. Uh, Sicily, a bit more harder. Well, I mean, Naples will be hard anyway because it's going to be controlled by Spain. And annihilate Venice. And that is one way we're going to go down. Then we've got to also recover the coastline of Asia Minor. Re-establish the theme system and take all of this. Then we've got to convert Asia Minor. And then restore the Pentarchy by holding all the five holy places. Which, I actually don't know where all the five holy places are. The random bits of Syria. One's Antioch. One's here. One's Cairo. or No, Alexandria, sorry. Not Cairo. And um, the other one's Rome. And someone else. Legitimacy or administrative power. I will lose legitimacy, I guess. I guess. Um, anyway, and then let's do... Oh, who likes... Who does like me? Wallachia like me. Let's make an alliance with Wallachia while we wait. Wallachia. What a funny name. Or Wallachia. I'm not sure. I think it's Wallachia. Um, anyway, then let's just call a diet. Uh, demand military support. Um, seek support. Minister to support. And... Grant monopolies to get diplomatic. So there we go. We've got more diplomatic power and everything like that. Patriarch. Uh, let's do the patriarchy. Give them some independence. Get some power. Because I'm sure that we can with this. Man, let's do. Let's do that one. Saint Michael. There we go. Excellent. So we now. So we get now with this uh, icon. We now get more manpower recovery and discipline. There are other ones. That one's all we want to start with. Um, 
Later we might want that one. Or unrest. Or even improve relations. I don't know. Depends on what you're going for. But right now we need the manpower because we're going to be in like war with the Ottomans constantly soon. And I'm sure they're going to go to war with someone very, very soon as well. The Ottomans. Oh, they've gone to war with Kandar. Excellent. They've not gone to war with me first. That gives me more, more time to get the Hungarians on side. Uh, that should just about be done. Hurry up, Hungary, and like me. Please. Um, Hungary now like me, so we can get an alliance. Excellent. Got an alliance, so we're pretty safe now. We're now safe from the Ottoman problems. Um, times in need. Consul of Athens, friend in need happens. Asking for money. We could ask for money. Oh, they're asking for help in the war against Poland. I guess I have to say yes. And they gave me money. I have to say yes because... Oh, but they're a well by Austria. So they should be okay. They should be okay, okay. I, I, I can stay in Constantinople and be a happy, happy little boy. Happy little boy, not worry about the scary things that are happening in the rest of Europe. Because we're going to... The Turks, you know, they've controlled... Greece for too long. It's got to got to go back to the Greeks or well, I mean we still call ourselves Romans, but the rest of us call us Greeks might as well anyway. We are Greek Orthodox at this point. So we need to take it. Anyway, let's see what else is happening. France has not declared war. Or France has got given Maine. In the first time I did this, France lost the war against England for Maine. And uh so I I think that would have been quite handy, but so it's going to be a strong France by the looks of it in this uh this attempt. But who cares? We can deal with it. Oh, Hungary's getting beaten up, and I'm definitely not going to help you. I need all my manpower. I'm sorry to uh, to attack people. Oh dear! I keep burping, and I'm like, I've just like downed like a load of squash, like before I started, so my voice wasn't going to like start croaking. But instead, I'm now getting like burps and stuff, and I'm just like, I don't want to burp on camera, guys. It's just embarrassing. Um, the Turks are just about winning that war. They've also got a lot of troops. I definitely need to get their troops, uh, the Hungary's troops in the war if I'm going to do it. Will Asia are at a truce with the Ottomans as well, so they won't attack. Um, I'll get rid of the mercantilism. I'm not so fussed about that. I really want to just get to the first technologies to get on with that. Um, we could put it at five speed. We'll do it at five speed for now. And then we'll bring it down when we go to war. Oh! Moldovia, do you mind sieging Athens? I'm trying to annex them. And I'm nearly ready. I can nearly do it. Okay. I should probably actually lower this. Because, um... I, I'm, I'm a bit worried that, uh, like... Oh, I can't do it because... I can't do it to the 1st of June. 54. Oh, I've got ages. Um, yeah, so I need I need to wait. I also really hope that Poland just end their war really, really soon. Who's attacking for Zeppelin? The Polish attacked in this war. Why are you attacking for Zeppelin? Stop. You rude people. Uh, I don't also know why. Who's attacking over here? Oh, they're in a sec. A separate war. Austria's in. Oh, Austria's in a sticky situation. Put it like that. Um, just let them have Zeppelin. You should have just let them have Zeppelin. I mean, you can't just go. Yeah, it's fine. Just have Zeppelin. But you should have. You should have allowed it. We can't afford to waste time. The Turks are the real. The real issue out there, guys. Can we deal with them? Um, no, I don't. I don't care about Austria's opinion. Um, Moscow would they ally up? No, absolutely not. Why would you not ally up then? Oh, because probably because you're a long way away, and um, other reasons that I can't think of. Um, Rostov. Everyone else just kind of likes me because I'm orthodox. I think. Oh, they just announced me as a rival. That's rude. I could attack, but I really don't want to. I just don't want to risk a war with them. And they'd have someone join them. Malaysia still won't join. 
when are Willacious truce up with these guys? Not for like another year. We can do it. We can do it. I'm sure of it. Um, can you just stop your war? I need Hungary in my war against the Turks because that's definitely going to happen. The Turks are coming, boys. I can tell. I can just tell. They, I mean, they haven't actually. Have they got castles? I think they did get castles spell eye on Constantinople. Yeah, they did. Oh, uh, there we go. Okay, it's over. Thank God. Oh, it's not. It wasn't that bad. They took like three territories. In the end of the day, I don't care about that land. Actually, I should I? Where's the Danube? The Danube's here. I'm pretty sure I should care about a little bit of this land. Oh, no. Is that the Danube? No, that's definitely not the Danube. Or is it? No, that might be the Danube. Where's the Danube? Isn't it like here? I think it is. So yeah, I shouldn't actually have to care about this that territory. Oh, that's fine then. I don't. I won't worry about that territory. Not one bit. Okay, well, Asia will join. Why would you not join? Hungary's in debt. They're in another war. Oh my God, Hungary, get out of wars. And then the. Polish conf uh, confederation and well, what Prussian confederations already happened. Jeez, Poland's getting lucky with this game. I should have asked Poland if they join, but they definitely won't now. And also, Serbia got some random land. How did they get this bit of land? Did you were you in the war? Were you in the war? Why were you in your ally? Up? Well, you might. But I I still have one diplomatic thing as well. Let's. Do that. Oh my gosh. I... Ottomans declared war. Oh my gosh. Can you stop going to war with people? Fine. We'll attack. Pike Square. Done. I got my Pike Square. Can you stop going to war with people? Hungary. What's this for? They started a war for Posny. Where the hell's Posny? Oh, here. Bloody hell. Excuse my French. So I just... I should probably help. Who, who are you being helped by in this war? I should look. Oh, Renaissance has happened. Great. Athen oh, it's me. Austria have abandoned... Poor Hungary, I think. Yeah. Oh, I don't know if I should stay with Hungary then. Should I attack the Turks? I can't now. I've... Um... I'm gonna stop this one. I don't really care about their relations now. Well, you don't have a royal marriage. I didn't even have a royal marriage. There, have a royal marriage, Hungary. Um, and then, can I attack the Turks? I could attack the Turks. Um, I think my son just died. Um, strongest there, smartest nephew. I'll just go with the strongest son. Oh, I died. Ah, uh, that that's what happened. Um, right, we better sort out my stability. There we go. There we go. Have a bit of stability, guys. Um, I might attack the Turks then. For a dern. Wish me luck, boys. Um, calling allies. I don't care about the Hungarians anymore. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Sieges in this are really overpowered. So, yeah, we just go bang, bang, bang like that. And we just take them. Uh, just for the allies. Yeah, excellent. That's, that's it. Done. <laughs> Next one. Um... Let's go up here. Take this. Just keep going up, guys. Oh, I have no leader. Um, make my king my leader, please. Thank you. Oh, oh, Hungary aren't in this war. I keep thinking Hungary in this war, but they're not. They're just in another irrelevant war. That no one cares about. 
So I hope you guys are enjoying the uh, campaign. If it's something a bit different, I just fancy doing it. I was like, yeah, why not? It'll be fun. And now this is where I lose my army. Or oh, is it? Or oh, it might not. It, this overpowered mod is a bit too overpowered, I think. I should definitely have lost that battle. Oh dear, I should have lost that battle, definitely. I feel I cheated a little bit there. Just a little bit. <laughs> oh dear. Maybe just the... You're taking that. Just get out of there, Wallachia. No one likes you. Get out of there, Wallachia. Let's see what we're getting in the peace treaty. I'll probably get... Oh, I wouldn't even get that much. Uh, what am I taking out? Marketplace. Or not taking, but... I'm researching a marketplace. I didn't even get that. Excellent. Um... Can I take charge? I can't take charge. I really wish I could. Oh, just let me take charge of this goddamn siege because I would do better job. We'd have it done by now. Uh, marketplace on. I can't do it on Constantinople probably because it's being sieged. Just a just a small chance. Uh, maintain vassal. Uh, I need them to like me. Churches. Excellent. We've got a church going. Well, we've not got a church. We've searched churches. Apparently, we didn't know how, what a church was before this period. What have we been building for, like, the last hundred years, then? I don't know. Just just some bricks. Just some bricks in a funny shape. Alright, go and attack them there. We might win that battle. Um, we absolutely should win that battle. I lost that battle! Wow. How dare they let me lose that battle. Where did my army go? Oh, it's all the, it's all the way down here already? Wow. It's a fast moving army. And then I'm going to win that battle ever so slightly. I really shouldn't have won that battle. Um, I'm going to see what I can get for the peace treaty now. Because I'm not liking how um, weak my army is. I mean, I get a little... I get quite a bit, but... Actually, no, my army's at 10,000. I, I would actually get max strength again. What's there else to take, though? What else can I take? I actually can... Hmm. Oh, I actually shouldn't have done that. My fleet now is just going to get crushed here. No! Oh, well. It was worth the try. My gosh! Uh, strongest son, please. Or smartest nephew. That's generally better. We'll go with the smartest nephew. Smartest nephew. Rule. Don't know what I'm on about. This is this is why I'm I'm gone insane, I think. Um also I'd like to suggest Oh, what can what am I at? Oh no, clear this. I wanna just get land, so I don't care about them. I don't care about other people that are like saying, Yeah, they I, I'd like to be independent. No one cares. No one cares if you want to be independent. Let's release nations, actually. Let's <laughs> okay, I now care about your independence. Because I can't do anything else. And all treaties. Uh, return cause. Uh, I can't do anything. Money, then. Money. Um, oh, no. Definitely not. No. How much money will you give me? Not much. 34. That's a bit weak. Come on. But I'll take it. Um, boundary dispute. Um, I'm going to press that goddamn issue. I'm not taking the stability hit. Right, what have I fulfilled? So this expanding Byzantium. Excellent. Well, that's what I planned to do anyway. That was the uh, aim of this playthrough. Right, what do I need? I need maybe some more cogs. Um... Focus on preparing the capital, please. I'm scared that it's going to get taken. I'm always scared. Um, call these places, please. And then let's just trade in Constantinople. And we can do Macedonia as well. Excellent. So we're doing well, guys. We have taken... We've taken some stuff. Um, give them support. Yeah, sure. So we're doing we're doing good. Oh, and we can annex Athens. I'm pretty sure now. Oh no, we can't. Why can't we not do it? First of June. Oh, we're nearly there. 
Come on. Hurry! Hurry! The Turks are coming! Oh, we can get an alliance with Serbia. I will take that alliance for now. Because I'm about to lose my alliance with goddamn Hungary. Because look at that. What has happened here, Hungary? I've fought a war against the Turks and won. And you still can't beat Bohemia. I mean, Bohemia are big-ish. But come on, they're Bohemia. I love a good story. Um, Do, do I, though? For nine ducats? Yeah, I guess I do. Uh, let's see what else is happening. Uh, Moscovy's doing okay. Eh, eh it's kind of like the usual map. Uh, Castile's going on, uh, taking out Granada. Good. We need to get rid of these pagan, the uh, pagans, heathens. Sorry if any of you are actually like Muslim. That's just a bit. But I'm, I'm, you know, I'm at war with, with uh, the Ottomans, and I've just got to. I'm re-establishing the Christian Roman Empire. It's got to be done. Actually, I've just realised making an alliance with Serbia probably wasn't the greatest idea. Hungary will cede... Jeez, they've already lost so much land of Hungary. And... Yeah, I was going to anyway. Serbia going to war with Albania, the Knights. I know, I'm going to pull out of this because I don't really want an alliance with you anymore. I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry. I don't want an alliance. No, you're not having a march. I'm an I'm annexing you like right now. Where are you? Come here, annex vassal. Done. Um, yeah, sure. We'll have a royal marriage. You're like, oh, that took like no time. Integration. Wow, that was quicker than I expected. They usually still take a long time. Um, let's get you over here. Please, yeah, do that. Uh, okay, our fleet's nearly remade as well, actually. That's good. And our army is... I don't know how big our army can get now. Probably quite big. Ah, oh, 16. Not as big as I expected. I was expecting like 20 or 30 and it's like 16. Oh. Oh, well. We'll build some more infantry, though. More infantry. And we should probably build some cavalry, actually. Oh, and we could do some stuff with these guys. National tax modifier, yes, actually. Oh yeah, I forgot advisors are really really cheap in this mod. It's far too overpowered, but it's fun. If you were here for a real EU4 campaign, you're in the wrong place. We're doing a fun, quick campaign to get through the mod base. Uh, just get have a quick campaign. Um, Yeah, we'll do that one. Why not? Let's just do them all. Uh, Landfalls limit modifier, yeah, sure. Um, so yeah, unfortunately... You may be wondering, where is the Macedon campaign? The Macedon campaign, unfortunately, has to have to come to an end because an update has caused the game file to corrupt and so I can no longer play it. I could go back and play on the old game file, but I decided uh, I just didn't want to. I didn't really fancy it. I just didn't really fancy going through all the effort of doing it. So, I mean, it wouldn't be too much effort, but I just wasn't really enjoying it. It was taking a long time as well to uh, get through that campaign. And I thought, why not? Let's have a slightly silly an overpowered campaign and just see what we can do. Let's see if we can certainly get the Roman Empire. We won't probably go for world domination because that'll be really, really long, but we'll see. So yeah, we've already taken a fair about amount of land in this first episode, so you can see kind of how it's going to go and speed-wise. Uh, I think I could attack Serbia probably just for like some random land, even if they but they're allied with goddamn Ottomans. Use caution. Why not? Use some caution. Um... I have cast spell eyes now on worlds. <laughs> the Ottomans are no longer a great power. I'm sorry. It was probably my fault. They like just destroyed. Oh no. Yeah, I've destroyed their hopes and dreams. I'm sorry. Um, Georgia. I could. Uh, I could try and bring Georgia in. Uh, jo where is Georgia? Oh, they're dead. They they died just as I was looking for them. Rip in peace, Georgia. Rip in peace. What are you fighting over now? You're attacking against Albania in the Serbian conquest of Les. Okay, so so Serbia's just taking on Albania. Well, that's nice of Albania. Uh, that's nice to Albania, isn't it? What do they ever do to you? But yeah, so we're getting through the getting through this quite nicely. Let's put it up. To, uh, we'll put it at five speed again. Why not? We can do it. Get some stuff done. If there's any boring parts, I will try and code it. But as we are expanding, we should do better. I'm actually going to bring it down to 4-speed. I don't like it at 5-speed. Far too quick. Naval Doctrine. 
Yeah, this is the really overpowered one where I just instantly steal all their ships. Um, I don't really want that. Because that's always a problem. I prefer to build my own. Um, maintenance can come down. I, I will pay the cost. There we go. Maintenance come down. That's always a better sh shout. I actually, to be fair. Does that one bring the maintenance down? No, it doesn't. That's the only one that... That doesn't bring maintenance down. I mean, there's a chance to capture... I mean, that would have been a bit alright. I could have had the chance to capturing enemy ships higher. But not too high. 100% is just a bit ridiculous. This person that made this mod must have been really upset that the Byzant they always saw the Byzantines die and was like, right, that's it. Oh, the Janissaries around. Congrats. Uh, I was about to say Austrians. Ottomans. Can't even get my nations right. I'm just sad to see that, like... Oh, and they'll probably restore the Union because they've got no alliance now with them. I would save them from, like, their doom. Already have standardized pikes. Excellent. We're doing quite well, then. <laughs> just a little. A little well. Eastern Militia apparently are better than... What was it? Eastern Med Medieval Infantry. Apparently apparently they're better. I didn't realize that was a thing. I don't know how Militia would become better. Um, also, I don't really care about our alliance anymore. I don't even want to talk to you. Iberian Weddings happened. Excellent. So that's happened earlier than expected. Uh, earlier than it did in the last one. Don't even think it happened in the last uh Episode. Last time I last attempt. I was supposed to say last episode. This is the first episode. What a fool I am. Uh, Moldovia, are you even a? No, you're just a. You're just a vassal. I don't even care about you. You're all happy because I've broken free of the yoke. That's all. You don't really care about me. Uh, when's can I? I didn't actually check. When's my truce over? Sixty-one. It's got another four years. I can't. I could attack Serbia, but they're allied up. I could attack Venice. Venice don't like me. That brings a lot of people in though. Put in the treasury, invest the money. Put in the treasury, please. I want to build a church. We're in Constantinople, even though we've already got like the best church in the world, the Hagia Sophia. At this point in history, Constantinople's fallen, but we've we stopped that. Well done, guys. Well done to us. Um, can we build more troops? Oh, I should. I could have looked there. Yes, two more units. Um, I will build... What are we on income-wise? I'll build two cavalry. Two cavalry. Oh, we don't have the money. More money, please, sir. Um, and our manpower is now 1,800. Uh, 18,000. That's good. That's excellent. So, yeah, I think the boundary's here. So I could keep Wallachia as an ally. Just let them do their thing. And then it just goes along here. So that's the empire. I might jump over a little bit if I f fancy it, but... Um, I'll spend the I'll spend the administrative points. Right, um, got my cavalry. Now I just need a bit more money to get the last cavalry unit, and then we're good. Then we're good to go. Um, yeah, I could just probably about just about attack anyone. I probably could even attack Genoa for. No, I can. And Genoa's allied up with so many good people. I definitely can't attack them. I just need to attack the Ottomans and then make an alliance with someone like France. Uh, could I already? I wonder. Absolutely not. They're probably like, no, you're far too long away. I need to take Italy. And then they're like, yeah, well done. You've done stuff. Peasants war. Oh, no. Poor old Hungary. They're just not even getting a chance. Uh, there we go. We've got... Uh, we had whatever. That was... We have docks on the way next. I don't even know what's happening now. Um, build some Eastern Knights for me. Eastern Knights. What's the difference between them and Western Knights then? Probably is actually something, and I'm just being silly. But anyway, let's have a look again. Let's, let's keep, I just like looking at the rest of the map. In this quiet part here be between it, we'll look at the rest of the map. Also, we're near the end of the episode, so I won't make a massive cut just to like then end the episode. So I might as well just see it, see it out. But we've done well, guys. And uh, yeah, if you've enjoyed this, do remember to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll probably say it again. And I'll probably continue to keep saying it. Because that's what you've got to do in YouTube. You've got to keep promoting yourself. And that's the sad, unfortunately the sad thing. Got to keep promoting. I'd, I'd be happy to just play and just not even mention it. But then I wouldn't grow, unfortunately. So I have to keep mentioning it. I'm sorry. Aragon, have you grown? You look like you have. Or have you shrunk?
It's one or the other. Oh, I think you shrunk. You lost Mercia. That's that. Uh, well, you got the Iberian wedding, so you don't really care. You got stuff. Genoa's taken Sasari. How? Oh my gosh, so much stuff put, popped up. Um. Well, yeah, I'm going to do that one because I get diplomatic power. Um. The coffers are low, I mean, are they? I I'll say, yeah, I guess they are. A little bit, 147. If you've got some money, if you've got some spare money, I'll take it. But if not, then that's that's fine. No! What are they should- No, oh, I'm breaking my alliance with you, Hungary. You're just a- you're just a problem. And um, Wallachia, there. So you'll let me. Anyway, guys, at that point, I am going to end the episode. If you've enjoyed what um, the episode so far, please leave a like and uh, subscribe for more EU uh, content. I will possibly do a um, a more uh, a proper a proper campaign if you enjoy this one. And I'll do I'll do one where we're not overpowered. Maybe not as Byzantines. Maybe someone like France or as, Ru or as Moscow trying to make Russia. Who knows? But yeah, anyway, guys, if you've enjoyed. Leave a like, and until next time, see you later.